Hi everyone, it's Louis here again with another great tutorial and today I want to talk about search engine optimization. I've been a web developer for over five and a half years and one of the most common questions I get asked by all my clients is can you make my site rank high on Google? Now, easier said than done. As web developers we're very good at making your site look pretty and uh, giving a nice aesthetic pleasing look to the site and a nice uh, user-friendly experience but the other side of it of getting your site to rank there's a little bit more involved than just developing a great website and what I want to do today is go through a couple of different tips and tricks that I can show you um, how you can get your site to rank higher and you'll also uh, realize by the end of this tutorial that the, the part about getting your site to rank higher on Google is not entirely a web developer's responsibility. We only do part of it and we can show you how to but you as the uh, business owner do have to put in the hard yards and the hard work yourself. So let's start the uh, tutorial and uh, hopefully my tips and tricks will help you get your business ranking a lot higher on Google. Okay, so one of the first tips that I can give you, and which is one of the most powerful ones really, is to name your business uh, according to a keyword that you want to rank for. So one of my clients, for example, uh, she wanted to rank for Dog Herbal Remedies, so she named her business Dog Herbal Remedies. And also, she registered the domain Dog Herbal Remedies, so that is her business name. By doing that, you are virtually guaranteed to end up on the first position of Google. Once again, keep in mind that if your keyword doesn't have the relevant written content on the site, well it's not going to rank uh, on Google. Uh, Google are getting much more clever at realizing who's trying to cheat the system. So it's very important to have relevant content uh, to the keyword that you're trying to rank for and by naming your business the keyword that you're ranking for you're bound to end up getting on the first position for that so that's a powerful way to definitely rank higher. The other thing I want to talk about is content. Now we have a saying in the web development world and that is that content is king and it is because Google doesn't really care how pretty your website is or how many nice pictures you have on there. All they really care about is the written content that you have on there. You probably have gone to particular websites where the website looked absolutely terrible but they had a very high ranking but if you notice something on that particular website they would have a lot of content, a lot of relevant content and Google looks at this and says well uh, you deserve to be on a higher position because when people look up something that is relevant to your website uh, you have the content to back it up. So an example of this I have a client that has a dog walking business called Dr. Do Little Dog Walkers so obviously if you type in the actual uh, domain name or the, the name of the business it's going to come up. However as a dog walking business she's not going to get much work by hoping that people are going to type in the Dr. Doolittle business name. So let's see what happens if we type in something like Dog Walkers Melbourne. She's based in Melbourne, Australia by the way. She comes up on fourth position for Dog Walkers Melbourne. Let's see if we type in Dog Walkers Bayside. Now I think for this one, oh, she's actually on first position for that. Um, so that's that's quite quite good. What if we type in Dog Minders Melbourne? Once again, she pops up on the fourth position for that as well. Now, if we go to the actual site itself, this is jam-packed with a lot of information, okay? Relevant content. This particular person uh, posts an article 
all virtually every couple of weeks um, she's constantly posting stuff on blogger and constantly posting new material on Facebook and that gives a, the, a website a lot of uh, a lot of power in the search engines because there's so much relevant content and Google almost sees this person as an authority on anything to do with dogs so whether you're typing dog walkers dog minding um, or any other titles that are in her article section you're bound to get her to come up on the first page so once again very very important to consistently update your site and put more relevant content on there if you can do this on a weekly basis I can guarantee you that within six months to a year you are absolutely uh, guaranteed to get results without a doubt. Now what about spending large amounts of money um, on SEO companies that are supposed to specialize in this area? Well personally I don't actually believe in doing this because basically over the last couple of years I'd say over the last maybe four or five years uh, search engine optimization companies have made a lot of money uh, and especially from smaller sort of businesses out there that are struggling you could be paying five hundred dollars eight hundred dollars a thousand dollars a month and quite frankly you are still probably not getting the results that you expect the reason for this is once again you yourself are not updating your site on a regular basis all the SEO company is going to really do is provide you with a bunch of backlinks to your site which a lot of them have no merit whatsoever anyway and Google doesn't pay much attention to them and then you wonder why your site isn't ranking. Personally, if I was to spend $500 or $1,000 a month, I would spend that on Google AdWords and get instant results. At least you know that you're, you're getting something for your money. And I would consistently, while spending the money on Google AdWords, I would continue to update my site, uh, do more blogging, update the Facebook page, so this will eventually start the the wheels turning in motion and you'll start to rank higher and higher on Google. Now another great way to advertise your business for free is uh, by doing a YouTube video clip of your product or your services that you might be selling. YouTube is a fantastic way to get your message across. It uh, allows you to reach millions of people and now you're even able to promote your video at a really affordable price through Google AdWords. I mean you can basically actually show your video to people for sometimes up to only one cent to two cents per a, per a view. So that's great affordability for anyone on a low budget that's trying to push their website and get their product across to, to the masses. One of the last things that I would do once uh, your website is finished and that is to list it in as many business directories available uh, in your area. Now there are an abundant amount of business directories that will allow you to put a free advertisement on there. So if you were to put your business in every single one of these, always remember a lot of these business directories pay a lot of money. Um, both to, to Google AdWords or SEO companies to to keep ranking much higher than what your business obviously will be because it's only been around for a short amount of time and these businesses are well established so it is really good to, to put your business in the yellow pages um, in anything that's giving you the opportunity to list your business for free and that'll definitely give you more of a chance of ranking higher so I hope this information has been helpful and gives you a better understanding of what it actually takes to get your site ranking on Google and that it isn't an overnight process. It does take time and does take a lot of effort, but the results in the end can be very rewarding for your business and, uh, and for the service and products that you're probably selling. So uh, I hope you've enjoyed this. If you do like my tutorials, please subscribe and we'll see you guys very soon. Bye for now.